As a superintendent, what do you consider to be your strength? Uh, focus on academics. Uh, academics is number one in everything we do. I feel like if we don't get academics right, nothing else really matters. And so we focus on that. But I feel like I'm an advocate for teachers. I look at myself as a servant leader. Uh, we try to get teachers everything they need to be successful, and that's my job to try to make that happen throughout the district. And then certainly, Running a school is a very complex uh, operation and we have to address our problems from all different angles and certainly we want to make sure that the facilities look good. Uh, we want to make sure that we're a friendly uh, district. We want to uh, be user friendly to the parents uh, in the community because after all we work for the community and we want to make sure we do our best to educate our kids in every manner possible. Well, certainly uh, the goal of Greenberry ISD should be to be exemplary district, to be exemplary at each campus, and certainly we'll take that step at a time to make sure that we get every campus recognized, but at the same time take the next step to make sure that we get every campus exemplary. But not just uh, academic ratings of, of Texas. We want to make sure that we're looking at the upper end and educating our kids. It should be a fact that a student can attend Granbury ISD and particularly Granbury High School and get the kind of education where that they can go and attend any institution of higher learning in the United States. I think that when we start to reach our goals of being the best district in Texas, I don't think there'll be a problem with board uh, administrator relations. Communications is a, one of the most important things that we do. And communication is a great tool when it works and too often times it doesn't. But certainly I would like to work with the newspaper in communicating, but also uh, open lines of communication. For example, anything that we do, uh, communications to the board on what we're doing, I've always made, for the nine years I've been superintendent, I make those exact communications, pros and cons, uh, as far as preparing for board meetings. I make those available to the board. I make those available to the public. And, uh, you know, folks have a vested interest in their district and in their kids attending the district. And so it's, ju it, it's just a matter of making that information available. And those that want it can look at it, and those that don't, it, it really doesn't be able to be here today to uh, take this position. Uh, I look forward to the opportunity to working with folks in Granbury. You know there's a, uh, a right way and a wrong way and there's a Granbury way and I hope that uh, folks in Granbury give me opportunity to learn to do things the Granbury way but yet at the same time uh, just rest assured that uh, we'll work extremely hard to uh, have the best school that we can in the state of Texas and uh, we'll work with the folks that we have. We'll focus on the strengths that uh, you already have. We'll focus on the good things that you're doing and try to capitalize on that and perhaps tweak some things to move in the direction of having an exemplary.